<laughs> All right, we're taking a quick drive because Mrs. Thomas did something interesting today. Went to the grocery store, pulled up. Rest. No, you won't. <laughs> I'm gonna tell the rest. You can fill in where it's needed. Okay, so I go to pull into the Walmart spot. I call them. I'm like, hey, I'm here. I need my groceries. And they're like, we only have one order and it's not fitting your name. But interesting. My last name's Thomas. The person, the only other person that ordered groceries was Thomas. And I'm not going to say his first name because it's not fair to put that on the internet without his permission. So, but his first name and my husband's middle name are the same. How weird. How weird is that? So anyway, um, my I called my dad and I asked him, I said, hey, are you going to the grocery store anytime soon? Because we haven't been going out. I had to go to the doctor yesterday and I had to take Ella to the doctor one day. And, you know, I've been taking the girls out to my aunts who they're not going anywhere and they're the only people we've been around. And so, yeah, just each other, and so, you know, I gotta have somewhere to take them when, um, when I'm doing my schoolwork, because you'd hear a two-year-old screaming in the background. Yeah. <laughs> so, anyway. And her attacking He said he, he was at Walgreens already, so guess why he picked us up? Some milk, and then he just reached, reached in and put it in our seat, um, through the, through the car window, which was great, because we needed some more milk. So, tomorrow... I'll go get my groceries. What happened was I ordered at 1 a.m. And if you know Mrs. Thomas, I go to bed kind of late. The other night I went to bed at 4.30 a.m. And two nights this week I went to bed at 1.30 a.m. I just like to work. That work, work, work. No, we're going this way, Claire, but we're going to go home. So anyway, um, we uh, I ordered what? groceries and I said that I'm going to pick them up the next day. And I forgot that I was ordering the next day. So meaning that I would get the groceries on Sunday, not Saturday. Look at those white trees, Claire Bear. Aren't those I pretty? saw some yellow ones. Yeah, there. right there. Some yellow bushes. Um, we've been talking about the green grass, how pretty it is. And we've been talking about the trees in bloom, the different types of white trees. Not all white trees, Claire Bear, are magnolia trees. But there are some beautiful trees that are blooming right now. And I, don't, that one. I don't know if you kiddos have been able to get out, but I thought you might enjoy a car ride. Um, it's so pretty. There's the middle school and the high school. Yep, middle school and the high school. You guys will be going to the middle school next year, Mrs. Thomas. Don't even say it. I'm going to miss them. They're not allowed to go. I'm going to keep them with me. <laughs> but she is going to miss you guys. I'm gonna miss you like crazy. I miss you guys so much. I have the best kids in the whole world. I have not met a bad kid, not once in my life. I've seen a lot of kids. Uh huh. You have not met one. Adeline. Oh, well, that's a different story. She's hit her terrible twos. I was terrible threes. Yeah, she was terrible threes. Did you guys see that cool car? That was really cool. Look at the trees. Aren't they beautiful? They are beautiful. Look at this. I wonder if you Now, I have a cousin. I'm going to do a little shout out. Maddie Robinson, who works at Especially Kids. She's amazing. Let me tell you about her. She's going to be a nurse, and she's a senior this year. Can I tell her? And I she tell won a what? What she win, Clever? Is she... She's getting a free pass to any college she wants. Right on. Well, any school in the state of Indiana, she won the Lily Endowment. We're really, really proud of her. All right, guys, this is where I'm signing off. I hope you enjoyed our ride. I love you. Miss you. See you later. Toodles.